Are you making this mistake when searching for homes in downtown Edmonton? Watch this video to find out. Hi, I'm Jen McPhillamy, real estate associate realtor with Yeg Pro Realty. Welcome to my downtown dweller series where I will be providing you with information and insight all about downtown Edmonton from a local downtown dweller's perspective. In this episode, you're gonna find out if you're making this huge mistake when searching for homes in downtown Edmonton. Before we get started, go ahead and click the subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on new videos posted weekly. So unless you know the specific street you wanna live on in downtown Edmonton, you could very well be making this big mistake when searching for homes in downtown Edmonton. So I'll just get right to the point. The huge mistake when searching for homes in downtown Edmonton is you select only the downtown community. If you do this, you're actually limiting yourself to the small downtown core and other housing options. So how do you fix this? Well, I recommend including the neighborhoods of Oliver, Boyle Street, Riverdale, and Rossdale. This will greatly open up your search and you're more than likely gonna find what you're looking for. When searching for a home in downtown Edmonton, it's also very important to know what types of homes are available in downtown. So you aren't looking for something that doesn't exist. Essentially, there are two categories of homes in downtown Edmonton. One, condos. This is low rise condos and high rise condos. And two, houses. This category includes attached homes like duplexes, townhouses, as well as detached standalone homes. Technically, some duplexes and townhouses are condos, but for this video, I've included them under houses. In the downtown core, the nucleus of all of downtown, your only option is condos. Except for the one house. The last single family home in downtown Edmonton hit the market September 2019. So depending on who buys it, it's going to remain a single family home or it may be converted to something else. Oliver, which neighbors downtown to the west, is pretty much the same as downtown. 99% of the options are condos. Most of the houses in Oliver have actually been converted to commercial spaces. So in Boyle Street, to the northeast of the downtown core, you're gonna find a mix of condos and houses. In Riverdale, which is also east of downtown and slightly south, you're gonna find mostly houses with the exception of three condos. One of them being in the River Valley in Riverdale and the other two being right on the edge of Riverdale on the edge of the hill with great views. And Rossdale. It's directly south of the downtown core in the River Valley. This hidden gem of a neighborhood, you're gonna find mostly houses and one condo. So it's important to note that Edmonton's River Valley has some pretty steep hills. So if you're gonna get a home in Riverdale or Rossdale, you have to remember that when walking to downtown, you're gonna to have to climb pretty steep hills. However, you'll find Oliver, downtown, and Boyle Street at the top of the hill. And once you're at the top of the hill, it's pretty darn flat. Your preference is a single family house, then downtown and Oliver, definitely not for you. You're gonna wanna stick to Boyle Street, Riverdale, and Rossdale. But if a condo is up your alley, there's a variety of different types of layouts and styles to choose from in downtown and Oliver. If you check out my website, jenmcvillamy.com, it's a great tool to see what's available in these different downtown communities. Also, I'm always available to answer any questions you have about real estate. So stay tuned for my future videos. We're gonna dive deeper into these communities. You're gonna learn about the different districts within these communities, the style of condos that you can get in these communities, getting around within the communities, and so much more. That wraps it up for today. So I hope now you won't be making that huge mistake that many people make when they first start looking in downtown. Thanks for watching, take care. Bye.